Well, every year, sadly, around 60,000 Americans are diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. It's the second most common neurodegenerative disorder in the U.S. Now, there's a scientific advancement for those living with Parkinson's disease off episodes. Dr. Robert Hauser is a director at the Parkinson's and Movement Disorder Center. Appreciate you joining us. Uh, this is obviously an extremely serious concern for a lot of people. First of all, what is Parkinson's disease and how does it develop? Yeah, Parkinson's disease is a progressive neurologic disorder associated with a loss of dopamine neurons. When dopamine, a brain chemical, goes low, that's when Parkinson's disease patients develop their signs and symptoms. And these may include slow and small movement, stiffness, and tremor. And we typically treat Parkinson's disease with levodopa, which is a precursor to dopamine, to restore that dopamine to treat those symptoms. That typically works pretty well for a while, but as time goes by, patients begin to develop times during the day when they don't get a good benefit from that levodopa. What are these, uh, I mentioned it in the intro there, what are these off episodes and when do they develop? Right. Yeah, these off episodes, that's the name for these times during the day when patients aren't getting good benefit from levodopa. They basically come in two varieties. One, when levodopa wears off or the levodopa benefit wears off. The other, when levodopa fails to kick in in a timely fashion. So these are times during the day when levodopa benefit is insufficient between doses of levodopa. And I'm here today on behalf of Kiowa Kieran to talk about the medication that they have available called Nurians, which is for patients with Parkinson's disease who are experiencing these off episodes. And why is this uh, approval for this such a, a big milestone in Parkinson's disease? Yeah, so uh, Nurians is the first and only FDA-approved adenosine A2A antagonist. It um, is approved as an add-on or an adjunct medication to levodopa uh, in patients with Parkinson's disease who are experiencing off episodes. In clinical trials, what was seen when you add Nurians to carbidopa, levodopa, patients experience less off time, which means they experience less, less time in these off episodes. And I think the importance is that we've been working on boosting dopamine for many, many years, and now we're starting to look at other neurochemicals in the brain. Here we're blocking adenosine, which acts as a break on the dopamine system. So adding neurons is like releasing the break to allow the dopamine system to work better and reduce off time. Lots of information here to digest. Uh, where can our viewers go to, to check more of it out? They can find out more about Norians at norians.com. They can also get information about Parkinson's disease in general at the Parkinson Foundation and the Michael J. J. Fox Foundation. I do need to add that Norians does have potential side effects. These include dyskinesia, which is twisting, turning, hallucinations, impulse control disorders, constipation, and insomnia. They should talk to their doctors about whether they have off episodes and whether Norians might be a good medication for them. Appreciate your time today, Doctor. We're going to put this on our website so our viewers can check it out again. Just go to firstcoastliving.net.